Hello guys, <clears throat> this is Tanya from Divine Time and Tarot. I'm here, I'm going to do a reading um, for Gemini. This is for September the 23rd to the 30th. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. And if you guys want a personal reading, you can look at my description, my description box below. All my information is there. Guys, this is a new channel. And um, I really would appreciate if you guys would comment, you know, like, share, su subscribe. And um, just show me some love. Just show me a little bit of love. Okay, y'all. Thank you. Okay, so I already got your cards out here, Gemini. So I'm trying to, what I'm doing is, I want to see what's going on between you and your partner, okay? Cards are already down, already saged, prayed over them. So let's get it moving. The first card you have, Gemini, on your side is the Nine of Pentacles. The second card you have on your side is the Ace of Swords. And the last card on your side is the Queen of Pentacles. Okay. Your partner has the two of swords. Your partner has the two of pentacles. Your partner has the five of swords. Whoa. What's between you guys is the eight of wands. What's crossing you is the emperor. Okay. And your outcome is the Five of Cups here. At the bottom of the deck, I had a Seven of Pentacles. So overall, someone's been planting seeds here in the situation. Your first card out was the Nine of Pentacles. So you're very abundant at this time. You are enjoying the fruits of your labor. You're enjoying being... Um, single you looking good you smelling good you handsome too or beautiful because this is vice versa male female very beautiful real handsome okay then we have the ace of swords here so there's a victory you got a victory somewhere and clarity you some clarity that came into you possibly regarding this queen of pentacles now the queen of pentacles she's all about she's very nurturing She's all about her money. She's working hard. She's taking care of her family. She's just, you know, all about her money right now. She's focused. So your partner has a two of swords, which, you know, they're being very indecisive. They're not really wanting to make a decision about a situation. Your partner could also be juggling money, bills, Hopefully not people, but they're trying to possibly trying to get their balance also. Your partner also has a five of swords, which is a very manipulative card. I mean, someone could be playing mind games. And um, fighting, fussing. Trying to get one up on the other person. Could also be cheating here. Could also be cheating here. So, I'm about to clarify this Nine of Pentacles to, you know, just get some clarification on, on, the, on these cards. Here. The Nine of Pentacles. is being clarified by the king of wands in the reverse so you're not wanting to take action on something you you don't have a whole lot of passion right now i think you're just having you're just out you know i think you just focus on yourself at this time you're not wanting to take action on any situation. Yeah, you're holding back. You're holding on to your money. You're just doing you, Gemini. 
the ace of swords why is it here being clarified by the ace of wands so you want you want a new you're wanting a new passionate beginning a new passionate and creative beginning possibly with a soulmate you've got the lovers here but there's a decision here between two people who is this queen of pentacles Queen of Pentacles is being clarified by the Two of Wands. So you're at a crossroad, crossroads with this person. You're trying to figure out which road, if you, you're trying to figure out which road you want to take. Is it with this person or is it by yourself? And you're stuck in this situation. You, you feel stuck here, but you're not stuck. This is just a mental um, things that's going on in, in your mind. Your partner has a two of swords, so why are they being indecisive? They, they're they waiting on their ships to come in, but they could turn, they, they could possibly have turned their back on this situation. Okay, it could be, they could have already made a decision about something too. Yeah, it looks like they're sneaking away here. <laughs> they're like, nah. It's either you or your partner is being very sneaky, manipulative, um, cheating, lying, you know, it's, or this could be your partner. Your partner is juggling. Let's see what the two of pentacles is about. We have clarifying the two of pentacles is the temperance card. So your person is, is healing. They trying to get balanced. Your person is trying to get balanced. Looks like they possibly might want a second chance at this also. What's... Hmm, yeah. We have the Wheel of Fortune. So, this is destiny. This is good luck. This is good fortune. Um, the wheel, the wheels are going to be turning in your partner's favor. The Five of Swords. That's not a good card to me. I don't like the Five of Swords. I don't like being manipulated. The... Yeah, they're moving away from this manipulation, your partner. They want to move forward cautiously. Could be dealing with a cancer. We have all the elements here on this table. We got fire. We have earth. We got water. Okay. Why is this chariot? Yeah. Your partner is, is um in the hangman position. Because they're trying to get a better pers a better perspective. On this situation, they want to communicate. Someone wants to communicate very quickly here with this Eight of Wands being here. But they are, it's being, um, there's somebody here that's prob possibly being kind of controlling here. Why is the Eight of Wands here? Why is the Eight of Wands here? Uh, wow. We have the Ten of Pentacles. So someone wants to build here with someone. You could be getting communication from either 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 you, Gemini, or your partner. Who wants to communicate about building. A foundation a stable foundation together but we have the emperor here why yeah someone wants something very stable we have the knight of cups here this is communication about you know an emotional offer here someone wants to build someone wants to make an offer here This emperor, this could be, you know, a CEO, a boss. This is also a father figure. This is also a father figure. Why is this emperor here? Okay, so this is someone in your past. This could be a water sign wanting to communicate with you about something very stable here that they're wanting. They want to build with you. Why is this five of cups here? Someone is crying over spilled milk here. Someone is regretting a situation here. 
but all is not lost because this person is basically crying over spilled milk but we still have two of cups be back on you know behind their love is still here there's two of cups that's still up being clarified five of cups is being clarified by the star card so this is healing this is having hope this is wishing this is also getting your balance here so <clears throat> Someone wants to fight for this. We have the Nine of Wands. Someone is willing to fight for this. Hmm. Someone wants to communicate quickly. Someone wants to communicate quickly, as I said earlier. But we have the Page of Wands here. So there is going to be some good communication coming in. And somebody wants to apologize and they want to make an offer here. Wow, Gemini. At the bottom of the deck, we have the Ace of Cups. So this is either a new love or somebody wants to renew their love with you. They are definitely in love with you, Gemini. They want, <clears throat> they want to get a second chance here. This could be a soulmate. And they're coming. They want to they wanna renew this. This is someone in your past, as I said, could be a water sign. So I am pulling you a couple of romance angel cards, Gemini. First one that pops out is it is safe for you to love. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. Let's see. Oop. Oop, 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 oop. Hold on, y'all. <clears throat> Second card that popped out is attraction. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. So, either you or your partner or both of you guys are attracted to each other. And it's safe for you to love this person. Let's see what else. One more. I'm going to get you one more. And let your friends help you ask for and accept support from others. Very soon, clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. Okay, Gemini. Thank you. And as I said, please like, share, subscribe, guys. Show me some love. Show me some love. And I'll talk at you later. Bye-bye. Love you.